the music, industry. Nowadays whenever these three words are said together in one sentence there is always a dark meaning behind it. I am sure most of you all are aware of this evil industry and the shady business that goes on behind the scenes. The likes of Michael Jackson, Prince, Tyrese Gibson, and now even Ice Cube, all talk about how evil the Hollywood industry is, and warn us of the many things that occur behind closed curtains. For those of you who don't know me, hey! My name is Iron, and I'm just a young person bringing the light of the gospel to the world and sounding the alarm to young people of today's society. Now, if you don't know who this woman is, then you are truly living under a rock. This is Doja Cat, this is her appearance before, and this is her appearance now. In the last two months, she has produced two songs, both of which are extremely demonic. Her songs paint the town red and demons literally contain so much demonic imagery and signs pointing to the enemy which many of her fans unfortunately are too spiritually blind to see. Check this out, I must warn you. If you are sensitive to dark imagery, I suggest you skip the next 15 to 20 seconds. Guys, notice, I mentioned that many of Doja Cat's fans are spiritually blind. What exactly do I mean by this? The Bible says in Ephesians chapter 6 verse 12, For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Guys, the scripture makes it very clear to us that our battle here on earth is not a physical one but a spiritual one. I see many comments on videos and shorts of Doja saying let her be her own person, she is growing up, fake fan, and so much more, nonsense. She has sold her soul to the enemy just for fame, money and glory, and some Christians believe that there is no way out of this dark loophole, but guys, don't fall into that foolish mindset. Jesus still loves her and offers his free gift of eternal life to everyone who accepts it. But Doja Cat must repent and turn away from such evilness or else she will sadly suffer the severe consequences. I don't mean to scare you guys and girls, but this is the reality of the world we live in today. Evil is good, and good is evil. The enemy Satan has become the ruler over humanity, and has only come to steal, kill, and destroy. I know that Doja Cat is not the only one but if you don't believe me about the darkness of the music industry, Listen to what these famous people have to say. The tradition, the tradition of great performers from, and, and I really want you to hear what I have to say. These guys work really hard at their craft, but the story ends the same. They usually are broken, torn, and usually just sad and the story is very sad in the end because the companies take advantage of them sign me, if okay. you sign me to a record company right. or a record deal let's suppose you have a record company right. how much would you give me the album sells for eighteen dollars right eighteen dollars yeah, yeah, yeah. all right how much of that would you give me well i i, I don't know how it works well no no uh, well, half 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 sound good yeah. all right check this out right. dollars if i sell two million copies I got 20 million dollars right, right. if I just sell 3 million copies I got 30 million dollars now who has the biggest record deal oh I see yeah right okay right, right. so Mariah kind of got screwed some of you may not have realized um, that I'm not part of the club and a lot of you listening to me right here right now you're not part of the club either. And what I realized with the club is what makes them so mad is when you don't want to be a part of their club. Now, guys and girls, I know this all may sound frightening and shadowed upon, 
But I want to let you know that there is a hope and there is a way that's found in Jesus Christ. The Bible says that the wages of sin is death but the gift of God is eternal life through Christ Jesus our Lord. Jesus already paid that price for us and he loves us so much that whilst we are sinners, he still died for us. The devil attacks us in many different ways, particularly in our weak spots. He might come looking all good and desirable, maybe through lustful temptations or through money but he will attack us, so remember guys, it's important that we are always ready and prepared for war in the spiritual realm, the word of God is our sword and armor, without it we are spiritually weak, so make sure to pick up your cross daily, follow Christ and always meditate on the word, if you are an atheist, or of different faith and got this far into the video, I want to encourage you to start with the first four books of the New Testament, Matthew, Mark, Luke and John. These four books go over the birth, life, death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. They will help you to see the character Jesus is and the example he is setting for us. Thank you all for watching to the end of this video. If you haven't already done so make sure to like and subscribe to join the Iron Nation and as Matt Lowe says, join me in being a menace to the kingdom of darkness, and help me reach 1000 subscribers by the end of 2023. Also make sure to join my Discord. I have lots to offer there. Thank you guys. God bless you. Iron. Out.